Welcome back. In this segment, we're going to look at printing a color profiling target in order to build a custom profile for Image Print Red. Now there's a few steps we need to do. The first step is to turn off color management in Image Print. To do that, we're going to go under Image Print and select Preferences. Now if you're on Image Print Red for Windows, that's going to be located under View. Let's select Preferences and we need to go next to our Default Profiles tab. Once there, look under Missing Profiles for the RGB setting. We want to set that to None. Once we've done that, Color Management is now turned off for Image Print. We can X out of this window. The next thing we want to do is move over to our Printer Selector. Make sure Image Print Manages Colors is selected. This automatically turns off Color Management in the Printer Driver. Also, we want to make sure under Using Profile, we're set to Automatic. Now let's hit the Setup button. This will bring up the Printer Driver window. I'm using a Canon Pro 1000 for this demonstration. Now each manufacturer could be slightly different, but we need to find our media type setting. For mine, it's under Quality and Media. Now if you're using an OEM paper, we need to choose that paper from the media type list. So navigate to that list and look for the paper type. If we're using a third party media, you should obtain that information from either the paper manufacturer or the dealer you buy your paper from. Now once we set the media type, we also want to make sure the print quality is set to the quality type we'll be using to print our images. I'm going to set mine to highest. And once I've done that, I'm going to select OK. Now the next thing we need to do is navigate to where our profiling target is stored. Each profiling system is going to have its own recommended targets to use. For this demonstration, I'm just going to use our target. My target's located in Applications, Image Print, and our Test Images folder. I'm looking for my 57 by 39 target. I'm going to bring it over to my layout window. Now once my target is on the layout window, make sure that your page size is set properly to accommodate your target. Once you've done that, you're ready to hit print and your color target will print without any color management on. Now in order to use the profile after you've built it, make sure you store it in the proper location and make sure you go back and turn color management back on in Image Print. So again, under Preferences, Default Profiles tab, I'm going to set mine to Adobe RGB 1998. Color management is now turned on and I can choose the profile from my list and begin using it in order to print images.